Dr. Jayanti to conclude, what is the message you'd like to give our viewers? So I would like to tell all the women that the incidence of breast cancer is on rise. It's on rise in India. The magnitude of the disease seems to be very huge, yet it is a very treatable condition. It is one of the few cancers when detected early and treated appropriately can be completely cured. And for that, what is important is early detection. And how is it that a woman can detect it early? There are certain methods to do that. One very important method is breast self-examination and mammogram, which I have already spoken about. So every woman who's 20 years and above need to do breast self-examination once in a month. And as the name suggests, every woman can examine her breast herself. And women who are 40 years and above, we recommend you do a mammogram once in a year. So let me just show you a small clip on breast self-examination. You can see that you can use it on yourself. It, there are some very simple techniques to do it. it. It's not a very complicated thing. And I would recommend that every woman teaches it to other women in their life. And that's the only way we can spread the message. Um, so please learn breast self-examination and teach it to other women. You don't have to be a doctor to teach breast self-examination to anybody. So let us see the clip. Yeah. The incidence of breast cancer is on rise in our country. The magnitude of the disease seems to be very huge, yet it is a very treatable condition. Breast cancer is one of the few cancers when detected early and treated appropriately can be completely cured. To detect it early, there are certain recommendations. Women 40 years and above need to do a yearly mammogram and women 20 years and above, it's recommended that you do a breast self-examination every month. Now let me show you how to do breast self-examination. Stand in front of the mirror as step number one with your bare body. Observe both the breast. Look for the size and shape of the breast. Observe for any swelling or any kind of a lump. Observe the contour of the breast, whether it is smooth or is it irregular. Also observe the skin over the breast, whether it looks normal or does it seem pulled inside. Observe both the nipples. Normally the nipples are pointing outwards. Is there any change in it is what you have to observe. In step number two, raise your arms as underarm region is also a part of the breast tissue. Look for any swelling or any skin changes in the underarm. It's a good idea to feel your breast when you are taking shower with soap on the body. Look for any small lumps. In the fourth step, in the lying down position, you need to feel the breast. Keep a pillow below your shoulder and the hand goes below the head. While feeling the breast, use flat of the three fingers and not to use the thumb. Start feeling the breast from the underarm region with the flat of the three fingers and keep feeling it move downwards and then move upwards again and then move downwards and that way you will feel the entire breast. Another method of doing it is in the circular method where you start feeling the breast around the nipple in a circular fashion, move outwards and all the time keep looking for any lumps. Normal life after breast cancer is possible if it is detected early and treated appropriately. Maintain a healthy lifestyle, eat a balanced diet, exercise regularly, keep your body weight under check, cut down on smoking and alcohol and breastfeed your babies for at least one year. Your health is your responsibility as you are your own best friend. Thank you very much ladies for coming and sharing your stories it's very powerful so i think we've covered almost everything so thank you very much for coming on the show today and thank you so much uh, thumbs up to you ladies really
Fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.